بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم ایوری ون اینڈ آئی ہوپ دیٹ یو آل آر ویل ہیپی ہینڈی ہیلدی اینڈ سی ہیلدی اینڈ سی ان شاء اللہ تعالیٰ آئی ہوپ یو ہیڈ اے گڈ ویک اینڈ لیٹ اے اسٹارٹ ٹو ڈیز لیسن ٹو ڈے از ٹوینٹی فرسٹ All right, first of all, circle time. Let's learn the spellings of no. Dictation word of the week is no. N-O, no. Everyone, please say no. And the spellings of no are N-O. If you are told to write the word no, no how would you write it you will you will write n and then o n o say no next we have to revise that the sounds the phonic sounds that we have done so far in our workbook that those are first everyone please Look at the sounds and say the sounds. Look at the sounds and say the sounds. What is this? Next sound. Ah. T. 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 E. 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 P. 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 Mm. Again. A. T. E. P. Mm. All right. Now backward counting 10 till 0. Everyone start backward counting. Starting from 10 going backwards till 0. 10. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, zero. One more time, everyone. Everyone count backward with me. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Two, one, zero. Well done. Next question. How many senses do we have? How many senses do we have? You tell. We have five senses. How many senses do we have? We have five senses. Name them. What are the five senses? Sense of? Seeing, sense of sight, it is also called sense of sight, sense of seeing, sense of sight, number one. Number two, sense of hearing. Number three, sense of smell, we smell things, we can smell things. Number four, sense of taste, we can taste things. And fifth one, sense of touch, sense of feeling. We see from our eyes. Everyone say, we can see with our eyes. We see from our eyes. We hear from our ears. We smell from our nose. We taste from our tongue. And we feel from our hands, skin. We feel things from the skin of our body. We have five senses. Sense of sight, sense of hearing, sense of smelling, sense of tasting, and sense of feeling. Sense of touch. All right. Next, dua before drinking milk. Are you... Saying dua before eating and after eating, are you? If you are not, 
please beta you have to always say dua before eating and after eating and another thing that you need to do you have to learn the dua before drinking milk that is allahumma barik lana fihi wa zidna minhu allahumma barik lana fihi wa zidna minhu everyone dua before drinking milk allahumma barik lana fihi wa zidna minhu one more time bete allahumma barik lana fihi wa zidna minhu good job let's discuss lessons for today today we need to do english two books of english workbook and excel for workbook we need to do page number 26 excel book page number 24 and 25 for maths we need to do book page uh, c1 page number 17 and we need to learn the spellings of 15 in science we need to do book page number 7 and 8 and for reading we need to do uh, ladybird uh, keywords with peter and jane book 2a page number 16 and for ort we need to do house for sale page number 12 and 13 so let's start with english first in english workbook page number 26 open your workbook english workbook page number 26 let's read write your name you have to write your name over here my name is dash first of all we have to write uh, we have to see all these alphabets a b c d e f g H I J K L M N O P Q R S T U V W X Y and Z. These are all the alphabets or all the A B Cs. You have to find the letter, first letter of your name in the box below, and draw a circle around it. then copy the letter onto the line at the bottom of the page now find the next letter keep going till you have written your name okay first letter of your name you have to find it and you have to circle it like this and then the next you have to circle it and you have to write it over here okay so let's say that we have to write the name of hamdan so first letter is h we have to circle h from here but every name should be starting with a capital letter so we will write the capital letter of h like this over here h then hamdan h a and you have to write a over here this is only for hamdan the other students will write their own spellings then m you have to circle m and then write m over here then d next letter is d in hamdan we will write d first circle it and then write it over here next letter is again a it's already circled we will write a over here again and the last letter is m mm, n circle n and write n over here you have to do better handwriting than me all right good job now next page you all have to write your own uh, spellings you all know what are the spellings of your name so you have to find the letter from these alphabets and then copy it over here 
Okay, now English Excel page number 24 and 25. What do we need to do in this? Excel book page number 24 and 25. First, write date, uh, classwork, and day. Beta, take it 21 920 C.W. And write Monday, M O N D A Y. The day is Monday. Write, write the date, classwork, and day. Learning the letters I to P. Say the names of the picture. Trace the lines to find the letters for each picture. Then trace over the beginning letter in the box. Okay. First thing you need to do that you have to say the name of the picture. This is kite. Kite, so you have to draw a line with K. K, K, kite. Then, L, leaf. L. First one is already done. Leaf, jug, igloo. You just have to join the pictures from the beginning sounds. And next, all, all, all the uh, pictures are already joined with the dotted lines. You just have to say the names of the pictures and then draw a line to the, the to the letter that are be the beginning sound. Kaka kait L leaf J J jug igloo. Ice cream. What's the boy doing? Jump. What is this? Kangaroo. Kaka kangaroo. L lamb. P penguin. N nest of orange. M monkey. Zzz. No, this is an ox. O, ox, o, ox, p, peg, n, needle, m, mug. Very nice. Let's do this one again. L, leaf, k, kite, j, j, jug, e, i, e, igloo. Very easy, Vita. You have to do it very beautifully. And don't forget to say the names of all the pictures. Okay, but another thing that we need to do, you have to, on page number 24, you have to color the pictures on this page that begin with the letter. Which letter? J. J, J. You have to see that which picture is beginning with the j sound. Here is j. Here it is. And what's the boy doing? He is jumping. You need to color the picture that is beginning with the j sound. You have to color the boy who is jumping. Another picture on this page that is beginning with the j sound is the jug. J, j, jug. So you need to color jug and jump on this page okay coming to the next page 25 page number 25 you have to color the picture on this page that begin with the letter m so let's see here is m and here is m m m monkey you have to color monkey and over here m mug you have to color the mug so these pictures you need to color and we are done with english work let's move on to the next subject which is math math book page number 17 book c1 page number 17 let's go to the circus let's go to the circus uh, Let's read first. 
color the tallest member of Zan's family? Blue. Okay. These are two families. This is Zan's family and this is Nyla's family. So, let's see Zan's family first. Zan's family. This is Zan's family. Who is the tallest? Tallest. He is Zan. He is not the tallest. Is another girl. Maybe the mama of Zan. And maybe he is the baba of Zan. Who is the tallest? Is Zan the tallest? No. Is this lady the tallest? The mama tallest? No. The baba tallest? Yes. The baba is the tallest. So you need to color Zan's family tallest member who is the father of Zan in blue color. You have to color this picture of Zan's father in blue color. Okay, let's read again. Color the shortest member of Nyla's family red. Okay, she is Nyla. Over here written, is written Nyla's family. And Nyla is over here. Here is Nyla's mother. Here is Nyla's father. Who is the shortest? Who is the shortest? Is Nyla's father the shortest? No. The mama is shortest? No. Nyla, she is the shortest. So, you have to color Nyla in red color. Here, the father is the tallest. So, you need to color the father in blue color. And here, Nyla's family. Nyla is the shortest. You need to color Nyla in red color. Let's read what is written over here. Dash's father is the tallest. Now we have to see all the members, all six people who are standing here. One, two, three, four, five, six. There are six people. See who is the tallest of them all. He is the tallest. And who is he? He is Nyla's father. And he is the tallest. He is the tall among, tallest among everyone. So, if we need to write whose father is the tallest? Nyla's. We will write Nyla over here. N-A-I-L-A. Upar aapne apostrophe lagani hai. You have to put that apostrophe like this. And S. Nyla's father is the tallest. Like this. You have to write exactly like written over here. Nyla's. Nyla's father is the tallest. And don't forget to put today's date, classwork and day on this page, Bitta Ji. Everyone has to write today's date, classwork and day. Okay, let's learn spellings. Spellings of 15. Here is 15. 1, 5, 15. Let's learn the spellings of 15. F-I-F-T-E-E-N. F I F T E E N F I F T E E N 15 15 F I F T E E N 15 One more time beta everyone say 15 F I F T E E N 15 15 Good job. Good job. You have to learn the spellings, Vita. Keep revising. We will be doing written work of 15 later, inshallah. Next lesson is science. Please open book page number 7 and 8. Science book page 7 and 8. I will just discuss few things with you. Uh, first of all, page number 7. Open page number 7 or if you don't want to open, you can see on your screens as well. Page number seven, we all are different. We are all different. Everyone is different from one another. No one is the same. We have, we all have skin. Everybody has the skin, right? And skin can be of different colors. It can be light, it can be dark, it can be of different colors. Eyes and hair can be different colors. It can be brown, it can be black, it can be green, it can be blue, it can be gray. There are many colors of eyes. 
and the hair colors are also different some have brown colors some hair colors some have, some have white some have black some have gray some light some dark there are lots of colors of hair and the eyes as well and we all like different things we somebody likes to play football somebody likes to play hockey somebody likes to watch cartoons somebody likes to uh, cook uh, and someone likes to uh, ride a bicycle we everyone likes different things everyone's interests are different so everyone is different in some way or some other way there is no one else just like you some people are the same in some things but not everything can be the same so you need to understand that everyone is different from everyone else and there is no one else just like you all right the next thing that we need to learn uh, is about senses uh, we we are uh, learning about senses in so many days so one more time beta we need to revise this page number 8 our senses we see things with our eyes we hear things with our ears we taste things with our tongue we smell things with our nose we touch things with our skin these are our senses okay we see things with our eyes we hear things with our ears we taste things with our tongue we smell things with our nose we touch things with our skin these are our senses look at this girl the word is written sight the sense of seeing is called sight the sight is used through eyes from eyes we see and then what is this written smell where do we smell from we smell from our nose and what is this written taste we can taste anything from our tongue what is this written hearing we can hear from our ears very good what is this written this is written touch how do we touch things we touch things from our fingers from our hand from our skin our whole body is covered with skin so we feel things we touch things with our skin all right next lesson reading reading ladybird keywords with peter and jane page number 16 let's read beta L read with me first and then repeat after me as well look look says jane one more time look look says jane l o o k look 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 says jane now you read look look says jane look peter look look peter look everyone please read look peter look now you read one more time look peter look have a look have a look you read please have a look one more time one more time have a look next come and look come and look now you read 
One more time. Come and look. C O M E. Come. Come and look. Peter has a look. Peter has a look. Peter has a look. Now you read. One more time. Peter has a look. Now all together read with me, Bita. Look, look, save. Jane, look, Peter, look. Have a look. Come and look. Peter has a look. One more time. Look, look, says Jane. Look, Peter, look. Have a look. Come and look. Peter has a look. Good job, Bita. You need to read it again as well. At least five times, Bita. And you have to read House for Sale, the book. ORT book, House for Sale, page number 12 and 13 also. All right. Let's discuss today's homework, which is of English first. Excel page number 28 and 29. Very easy, Bita. You need to do it on your own. Don't forget to write today's date, homework and day. And you have to learn the dictation word. No, N O no. And reading that we did today of book 2A and ORT page number 12 and 13. All right, Bita. That's it for today. I hope you will be completing your work. Inshallah, Take care of yourself, Bita. Allah Hafiz, everyone.